my darlings. Make sure you like, subscribe, and hit the notification button for more waifu. Oh, and don't forget your headphones. <laughs> now sit back, relax, and enjoy your wonderful waifu. What did you hey, expect? You. The sin of sloth to be clean and tidy? Oh, yeah, I guess you're right. I hope he hasn't died in here from the smell. Magda, uncover your nose. We don't know what sloth is capable of, so we don't want to start off by offending him. Oh, come on, Usha! You gotta admit, it's vile. I agree. Now uncover your face, spirit. Fine. Seems it's a mix of things making it stink like that as far as I can see. Yeah, now that I'm looking, I see all kinds of things thrown about the place. Empty food containers, clothes, and trash everywhere. I get he's like, the sloth. But why would anyone want to live like this? I think I'm gonna hurl. Did the smell get worse? I think we're getting close. Whatever you do, Magda, hold your last meal down. No one's ever made it this far. He might be mad. Okay, Usha. Okay, Usha. I'll do my best. Ugh. Why couldn't I have been locked in here with a servant? I grow so tired when I have to fetch my own things. Why did this have to be my life? What did I do so wrong to deserve being locked away without one single demon to do for me? Is... is he feeling sorry for himself? Right across his bed, feeling bad about himself. He kind of sounds depressed, Usha. Maybe that's why he lives like this? He's so depressed, even feeling himself exhausts him. Well, I guess there's only one way to find out, huh? Sloth? Who... who are you? How did you get here? Never mind that. Has Satan finally gone easy and sent me a servant? Uh... N no. I'm not here to be a servant. What about that lovely spirit traveling with you? She looks like she'd be a great <laughs> servant. <laughs> <laughs> Usha, stop laughing! I make a great servant, okay? You've only seen the worst side of me because we're in this situation. Oh my gosh. Magna, Magda, no offense. 
but you would be like the worst servant ever. <laughs> that is not fair. I can fetch waters and brush hair and stuff. That's not all there is to being a servant, you know. Enough. Of course you aren't here for me. Why would you be? No one ever comes here for me. Oh no. Sloth, we're sorry. We actually are here for you. You... You are? Really? Yes. I am here to face your trial. Oh. So really you only want to use me? Get out of here! I have some important things to take care of. By. My. Self. No sin. I'm here for your help and your ultimate weapon. Satan threatens the fabric of the cosmos, and I'm here to stop him. Don't care. Bye bye Sin, your life is threatened. Are you still talking? I told you I don't care about the cosmos. Not your life, and certainly not my own. Without a servant, my life is so exhausting I almost can't bear to live it anymore. I'm just too tired to do anything about it. <sighs> this damn bed has no support anymore. And I have no one to get a replacement. Sloth, I am the daughter of Satan. I can access the blood magics used to bind your prison. I can alter it so a servant can come and go for you. Only one daughter of the great king? You could offer me one hundred servants at this point. I still don't care. I told you, my life isn't even worth living anymore. And I really couldn't care less about anyone else's either. And you were worried about me offending him? Only one servant, Usha? What? The hell are you doing? I have an idea. Just follow my lead. Sloth, don't you hate it when demons feel like they're more entitled to things than you are? For example, Usha only offering you one servant when she could have thousands at her disposal? Wow. Someone who finally makes a little sense. Yes. That was pretty insulting, wasn't it? Totally. But Usha doesn't mean any harm. In fact, she just wants to protect everyone she can from Satan. The same guy who locked you in here without a servant to start with. If she shares his blood, she's not harmless. She shares his blood, but not his mindset. She alone has the power to stop him because of that. But we need your weapon, Sloth, so we can help you too. A different mindset? <sighs> Please. All demons are the same, royal blood or not. What do you mean, Sloth? <sighs> this damn mattress. It is the most uncomfortable thing. Satan really did intend to punish me good, huh? Magda? <gasps> I'm from heaven! What if I told you I could get you an angel feather oh, bed? An angel feather bed? No way. I've wanted one of those since I was a child. 
You can really get that? Yeah, I can. I mean, I promise. I'll have your new 100 servants bring it straight to you once we save the realm. Perfect. Those things never go flat. I'll make sure my servants fluff my mattress daily and take the best care of it. I'm glad something so precious is going into caring hands. <laughs> oh, I'll also have them bring me foods from all over to try. And they can clean up. I'm tired of keeping this place so clean by myself. Uh, yes, Sloth. But in order for me to win, you'll have to begin your trial so I can face it. Oh, yeah. The trial. There you go. So, Magda, was it? Do you pluck the feathers off the angels before or after they die? Uh... Wait, what? No warnings before your trial? <sighs> you already got me to start it. I'm so tired now. <sighs> that was a lot of energy to spend to start it up for you. So... You're welcome. <clears throat> Alright. I'm going to bed. Don't die before I get my mattress. The trial was to get me to care enough to begin it. You've already passed. Now go through that door and leave me alone. I'd like to dream about my new mattress getting fluffed by all my servants. What? Shh. Let's go. Jeez. Okay. So, that was the weirdest trial yet, yeah? Mm, not so strange when you remember the sins are all overpowered demons. My kind is strong-willed and stubborn to others. Without proper motivation, a demon will never assist you. But why are you trying to save the universe, then? Why? I mean, I know why, but if a demon is a demon is a demon, then why do you care enough to stop Satan? <sighs> Sloth was right. And I'm the most selfish demon there is behind my father. Huh? This all started so I could spare my own life. I never wanted to join you on this journey, Magda. I don't wish to be queen of hell. I don't want to be known as a hero of the universe. And I don't want anything. Other than the King of Darkness on the end of the blade of whatever this weapon is. My selfish game is to kill him before he kills me. Luckily, my goal meshed up with yours. But we're friends, Usha, and you've started to open up and be different. Now you want all of those things, right? I'm a demon, Magda. I am no different than they are. Let's go, spirit. We still have three sins left. <laughs>